and visited the um, the tool dealer that I bought quite a few of my machines, um, in fact most of my machines from. And uh, what I specifically went over there for, and I phoned up about in advance, was I, I wanted a decent uh, tilting table uh, for the mill to do some uh, work on cylinder heads. And I come back with this rather splendid ab wood. And uh, it's using uh, the same base as uh, quite a lot of devices. And it, uh, it's a swivel base. And also, you gently let it off, and I try not to get any fingers trapped. Hopefully you can see what I'm doing here. So we've got a graduated scale along this surface here, and you know I've given it a good, good clean, um, but really no nothing else. And it's uh, there's the odd little ding on it that could do with stoning down, but really pleased with that. And uh, eighty pounds I paid for this. Now, uh, of course, I did go over with a bit of spare cash um, in case there were any impulse buys, and I was specifically looking for um, number three Morse taper drills. But um, uh, he'd recently had a guy come in and, and you know buy quite a lot of tooling, and I think the, the Morse tapers had gone. Um, but. I did spy a nice set of V-blocks and uh, these were made by Eclipse, it's a good brand and that's a matched pair and that's an orphan uh, but they uh, they feel like a reasonably good good match still and I might just give that a little uh, give the whole set a, a clean up on the surface grinder when I get it running and uh, well, that set of three was ten pounds, and he then offered me one of the ubiquitous spin indexes, um, usual made in China. This one feels quite nice. It's basically new. It had a tiny little corrosion spot in the. Uh, the taper, but you really can't. You can see it. You can't can't feel it. It was still in its packing grease, but obviously got some moisture. And now, if you've got something that takes five C collets, you're going to need some five C collets. Uh, uh, yeah, it's 50, 15 pounds for this. So the final item, if I can get it up onto the table without damaging myself. Let's just back out a little. In a nice made in Britain metal box is a set of 5C collets and it even came with the list of what's in there. So um, some metric, pretty much all of the um, um, the rest in metric. It, it, uh, sorry, imperial in in thirty seconds, and also um, in the larger green boxes. There's your um, um, square and hex five C holders for doing quick indexing in the vice, and. That's that set with uh, you know the, these these uh, these collets have never been out of their their packing. They're still heat sealed in, and I don't can't remember exactly how many collets are in here. That sort of uh, 
10, 20, 30, nearly 40 collets, uh, plus the blocks, um, 150 pounds. So, I'd like to put a little plug uh, for Richard Brown at Project Machinery. Um, you'll find them under the, on the web under that name. And I mean, I've been a customer of his for quite a few years. I mean, probably 15 years I've been buying stuff from him.